to reach all checkpoints by the shortest possible route, testing endurance, engineering and navigational skills. We could, could be going a little quicker, but uh, we're learning. We're, we're virgins, we're minor virgins. The winner of the event is the team that manages to compete the course with the least distance recorded. It's very tough. It's always tough. I, I don't know what to say, I'm too tired. At the notorious gauntlet, competitors took time to repair and service battered vehicles before resuming their quest. And I think we're doing pretty well. We've done the gauntlet, so the toughest part is gone now. The others, I think the last seven should be able to do it pretty good. The challenge does have its dangers and several people were injured and had to be evacuated. A rock fell on top of my foot and I had a crack and I think it's the metal tarsal burn on the top that's gone. And then it was what, how many kilometres did we do after that? Oh, about four. Four or five and four then mechanical five. failure and then that was it, end of charge for us. The rugged terrain often seems impassable, but these drivers manage to manoeuvre over and through it. We've changed wheels, yeah, we've learned how to use the jack properly and connect the batteries and <laughs> all sorts of put things. Put petrol in. <laughs> um, no, actually, we put kerosene. It goes faster. It goes faster, yeah. <laughs>